dies when he refuses to take a stand for that which is true. Yeah. So we're going to stand up right here amid horses. We're going to stand up right here in Alabama amid billy clubs. We're going to stand up right here in Alabama amid tear gas. We saw at least 100 injured people in the hospital, in our little, very little three-room emergency room in a very short space of time. Mm -hmm. They all had head lacerations from the uh, state troopers' batons. Mm -hmm. One of the doctors, as he stitched, he kept saying to people, I know that you would never do this on your own. It was outside agitators. We are here from St. Louis to demonstrate, to witness our love for our fellow citizens in Selma. It would be a peaceful demonstration, but we were guilty of civil disobedience. In all probability, we would be on some FBI roster, but these people were our neighbors, our brothers and sisters, and we had every right, if not an obligation, to be present that day. It's one thing to have a right on a piece of paper, but if you cannot express that right in the way you live, in the way you vote, in, in the way you are self-determining, then something has to give. Oh, freedom, oh, freedom, oh, freedom over me and be Church say amen.